Hey guys, just going to do a video here on how to um, change your uh, snare strainer if you if it breaks or if you're putting on a new one. Um, this one here is a Drumcraft Series 8 maple snare, and the Drumcraft um, strainer itself there. It had snapped off and they were very nice to me and sent me a new one for your charge. Uh, so thanks a million from uh, Drumcraft for doing that for me. This whole unit will come out and it'll be stuck on just like that at the side when the two screws in. So it's literally a case of taking out two screws, taking this unit off and then putting two new screws on. I'll take you through it bit by bit. Um, I have a star screwdriver the same size for the screws and just in case I have my um, screw gun there. I'm just going to go with the <clears throat> the hand handheld screwdriver. These are the two uh, screws there and I just had to go with them. They're coming out fairly easy. So you just want to take out the two screws. Every snare st strainer will be a small bit different but it will be pretty much the same thing that you'll have to do. The same process that you'll have to go through each time. So that's those two screws out, and that's connected onto this part. This is the part of the broken snare strainer, and that should pop off as it did there. Okay, so the next one, just take off your screws. Just get this ready for um, when you're going to put it on the snare. Here you can see I've already just put one in and what I'm doing is I'm just leaving the screw flush with the outside of the plastic bit that you just seen there. So I'm going to do the same to this. It's going to be the last piece of it. The putting this on the side. Now the two screws are going to go through the wood and into here. Into the, uh, the top hole and the bottom hole. This is where something could go wrong whether um, the holes on this drum are different size to the ones on the strainer but I've just checked it out now I think we're okay and um, the other point as well don't put it up this is a stupid mistake but it may happen don't put it up like that remember that this is on it's backwards it's upside down so you're gonna have to get the strainer part and put it in upside down also okay so it could be something that might happen so I'm just gonna screw these um, two screws straight in Okay, so that, it's on there, and I was going to go with the screw gun, but there's no point because it's not moving, so it's fine. Um, so, right, the next step is you're going to have to put on your skin. Okay, I have a Remo uh, Diplomat snare uh, skin, so I'm looking forward to this. I haven't put one on. They're very thin, so I can't really tighten it that much. Uh, but I'll pop this on and then we'll take it from there. Where your snare wires go through in the on the rim of the snare, it's going to have to be exact to match up where you have your snare, the snare wire, um, come through. So I'm just going to, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to uh, attach this to this and make sure that there's a fine, that it, it goes nice and straight from the snare wire from this position all the way over to, as you can see, the other hole and down into the the other side that catches the other the snare wire. I'm just going to attach this, take this off this, the old snare strainer, and attach it to the new snare strainer I have on there. And is there a straight line going from here all the way down to here? And is it possible for me to link it in there? Yes, it is, because that's just going to go through there like that. Now, there's one more thing that I want to show you. 
you see the way as you look here maybe this is a bit OCD of me but it's actually as well to do with the sound you see the gap from here to here and the gap from here to here see the way there's less of a gap here and less of a gap here that's why you're gonna have to undo this again excuse me to undo that and then slightly shift it over so that the gap is even it just makes the snare sound a bit better uh, so you're gonna have to do that as well so there you go it's done and it's dusted just got it even so that the two sides kind of matched up now again I'm sure there's another way of going about this it's not exactly rocket science but it could be something that you get stuck on um, so let's see let's see how she sounds nice crisp snare now camera angle again like some stra snare strainers are going to be slightly different um, th this one was for drum craft as you can see here um, and it's all working good double check I suppose when you're you know when you're finished up put the pull, pull the lever down you might have to do some messing around with this 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 lifts it up and lifts it down and also check it is it fully functional like that don't pull it too tight because you don't want to um, break it again or you don't want to, depending on how uh, thick your skin is at the bottom. So we'll just check it out like that. Put the clip down. And then put the clip up. Beautiful. Guys, take it easy. Catch you soon. Good luck.